um, the schools into the educational systems from daycares to schools. And the first thing is, in the consulting, we look what is the imbalance in the system? Where is it? And there we bring in the points. It's not of changing everything, because there are many good things in all of the educational institutions. Each educational institution tries to do the best. But some things can be improved even without investing money. For example, if you have an older student taking care for a new student who comes, and you have a supervisor with them who guides them, then the new student will be able to integrate in the system, in the educational system, much faster. That doesn't really cost more money, it just needs a different focus on bringing students together and not separating them by class and age. By having students teach other students, for example. That doesn't really cost extra money. But then, of course, we have many things that cost money. And that's, of course, a part where I say we also have to announce the politicians to focus on that steps that can really bring education forward, and especially our society. Because education is building our society. There's no way around. The first 18 years of life, there's nothing besides education from parents, teachers, media, politicians, from economy, advertisements, that's all education, it's all telling the young people something. And when they are turning 18, 19, 20, their personality is built by all what they have experienced.